This little bastard gets a birthday extravaganza. Find out how that goes down by clearing the invitation. Do I just sign out or do I switch? This is Gizzy. Hey Gizzy, we're in the middle of recording real quick. Oh, hi. Am I yeah, say hi Gizzy. Hi. God, I hate you. I hate you Gizzy. If you're watching this. Having a wonderful time answering questions. Right to Q and a in New York. So here we are back again. Uh, meeting up in New York for a pristine event, the U-Cube meetup, because uh, Minorama was delayed or whatever is happening with that. So we decided to get together, since we're in the same area, to do another relationship Q&A, because in the scheme of things, these get views. Unicunt powers activate! So should we get to the, uh, should we get, shall we get to the questions? Banana Man asked, why is Steve so tall? Genetics! Moving on! Uh, Village Hearts asked, is, is Stintz still alive? Well, let me tell you right now that it's a No. No, 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 no. Can I just- it's Vince. No, just... no, no, no. Okay. Andrew Purdy asked, how long have you known that Steve was gay? Well, From the like moment that I met Natalie, I knew I was gay. He's my lesbian girlfriend. Orange Mocha Frappuccinos! Were you planning on me saying that at the same time? No. Hey, you know what the best part about this video is? This one might be in focus. Living in a world so cold, wasting no way. Oh, Andrew Purdy, Andrew Purdy has another question. How long have you known Steve was gay? KP Pennels, KP Buenos asks, who wears the pants in the relationship? Well, KP, what's a very equal relationship? Stop pinching my ass. Stop pinching my ass. Stop pinching. Tell him the truth! She wears the pants. She wears the pants. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. Carrie Yake asked, actually this is Steve's alt account, uh, that asked, Why is Steve so awesome? Why is Steve so awesome? I don't know. What is the reason? It's the power like of Unicut behind you. Also though, there's probably like other reasons too. It's why probably your, it could be your farts. Well, I mean, it could just be like his masculinity and his overbearing, um, Manliness, or like maybe his um, nice question. overbearing manliness. <laughs> Bella asks, "How many subscribers do you think you will get by 2015?" Well, I tell you the truth, I check Social Blade quite often, and its predictions I don't remember, but I'm sure it'll be somewhere around 300,000 subscribers. You already have 300, subs uh, 300 I'm quitting, subscribers. I now quit YouTube. Yay! More for me. Check out my channel at YouTube Meetup. Do it! This is the time to promote. If you had a time, it's now! YouTube.com slash the zombie unicorn. Why? Because you're an idiot. Fantastic. Jason Splix asked Have either of you two ever thought of becoming a gynecologist? A paleo paleontologist. A vagina doctor. Is that what that is? Is yeah. that a gynecologist? What's it like going to one of those? It's, uh, it's awkward. Well, do, you, do you get guy doctors or girl doctors? I usually get girl doctors because I don't want you a guy. You've a guy doctor though? Uh, not on purpose. I don't want them feeling around. And in not there. on purpose, but you have gotten a guy doctor before. Yeah. How was that? Do you feel violated? Yeah, I don't want to talk about it. Blue Monkey asks, "Why was there? Why is there a good-looking guy in the mirror every time I look at it?" Will Ooh. Will actually Will Barlow. Gizzy. Will Barlow actually answered this question for him, and he said that it was a framed photo of himself. Um, I but think it kudos was to you, Will. Yeah. You're the most beautiful Englishman I know. And James, you're close second, I'd say. Gizzy. You're third. Oh. Top five. Top five. <laughs> Brutality asked, "What's your most embarrassing merman?" What is your most embarrassing merman? Whenever we were first started talking, and we were talking about packs and like parties, and I was telling him about Twitch party and like other parties like that, and he was like, "Yeah, you should invite me out to some of those sometimes." And I was like, you you don't need to be invited. They're, like, free and open for... To the and, public. Yeah. There's this one thing that uh, Natalie keeps bringing up. It's not really embarrassing, but it's just, like, you start to you start to think in your in your mind, like, oh, God, she's bringing it up again. And it's the, um, it's a thing that's... Uh, let me just do this in Natalie's voice. There was a time where I lost all of my subscribers! They all went away in one day! It's all so split, I swear! Dan Steele's Taint asks, Can you give me some fat sa- Well, Dan, let me tell you- let me tell you a secret. Uh, 
I pretty much make a little bit over minimum wage, so therefore you cannot have any of my money because I sure as hell need it. Gizzy! I noticed that liking a video doesn't really do anything because there was a there's a point a few weeks ago where I asked for likes on a video. I felt bad about it, but I asked for likes, and uh, it sure it got like mm. three times the amount of likes it normally conversation would. Conversation is boring. But it's like it doesn't do anything, and that's a tip for all you YouTubers out there. Don't get people. To, in fact, get people to dislike your video. Thanks for coming out.